This is the enclosure for my two Egyptian spiny mice. Quick disclaimer, everything inside of this tank has been sanitized or sterilized. I'm talking the hay, the sand, the leaves, the bark, the wood, the hidey huts, everything fabric, every, and everything. Whether that be via baking, boiling, freezing, UV sterilization, it has all been sanitized before being put into this tank. Anyways, let's get started. One more quick thing before I stop talking. The tank I have here is a 40 gallon breeder. No, I am not breeding Egyptian spiny mice, but they call it a breeder tank when instead of, oh, hi Twig, instead of longer or taller, it is deeper. You can see here it's a lot deeper than most tanks, but it's not exactly tall or long. Yeah, this is for my two Egyptian spiny mice, and I would recommend a minimum of 10 gallons per spiny mouse. Doesn't matter the variety or species. Doesn't matter if they're dwarfs or not. Minimum 10 gallons per, but preferably 20 gallons per, which is what I'm doing with my two Egyptian spiny mice. By the way, their names are Twig and Stick. But yeah, let's get started so I can stop talking.